it's that time of the year again it's december and it's the christmas season <laughs> you know december is like one month everybody waits for from the beginning of a new year this is particularly me talking i'm always anticipating december i'm always anticipating everything that has to come with the christmas season as a matter of fact christmas is like my favorite time of the year well in everything you do the one thing you do not want to have in december and in the christmas season is a disorganized christmas celebration no matter what so get a book and a pen let's plan and organize a less stressful uh, christmas celebration hopefully hi guys welcome to my channel and welcome to my first christmas planning video if you're new to this channel thank you so much for even clicking on this video please i would very much appreciate it if you subscribe to see more christmas content <laughs> and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for sticking with me and without wasting time let's get into this video because you have to start planning this is the fourth day i'll be the fifth day of christmas of december <laughs> sorry so the first thing you want to have checked out is your budget because december is going to happen with your budget so you don't want to be planning out of what you want to spend and coupled with the fact that january is around the corner and january has like eight weeks packed in it <laughs> okay i'm exaggerating but there's always a need to have something to start the new year with so please i know you want to have a dirty december but it's important to budget what you want to spend for the season so guys one thing you want to do one thing you should write on that list now is your budget now tell yourself how much do you have to spend for this christmas season how much can you allow how much do you need to spend you don't want to be doing extraordinary things <laughs> okay you don't want to be doing extravagant things though i know you want to have you want to have a fun time fun packed christmas but at the same time you don't want to be going bankrupt because you want to celebrate christmas there's still many more christmas to come that's the truth about this so if your budget has been checked and you've mapped out everything you feel the next thing to do is make a proper list now in this list you need to write down a lot of things because it's going to help you utilize your time and your money now the list may sound irrelevant but it's going to guide you trust me i do this every single time and it works out for me so after you must have finished um checking out with your budget it's time for you to make a list now this list is consisting of both things you need to buy things you need to do and timing because it's going to guide you through now things you need to buy are usually much so you just can't have all of them in your head that is the truth about it you can't have everything in your head so it's important that you actually categorize them write down the things you want to buy now most times you don't even remember everything while writing so imagine going to shop without even writing anything at all you end up going like two or three times or even more depending on what you want to buy so writing down what you need to buy is very important so you don't miss out on anything you want to buy it's also important that you write down places that you want to go to places that you think you should be in with your timing now this timing part of it is very important because you might have like two or three events clashing without knowing because you didn't write them down you then be on the fence so please try to write down your um, appointments, your, you know, dates and all the family dinner you already planned out. So you don't mix anyone up and you don't miss anyone at all because it's the Christmas season. You need to attend every one of them. <laughs> okay, guys. So now in the aspect of um, writing down places you need to be, if you're going to be traveling this period, you might also want to be writing down how you want the whole travel to take place now literally you can do this with your phone because your phone is very mobile you might write down this stuff now in a notebook and forget it on the day you need it so please if you have a phone so you have a note um, on your phone where you can jot down how you want your travel to take place and how it's going to happen for you the things you need to buy for your travel 
very very important now let's talk about prepping things through now you need to prep everything as a matter of fact from 23rd 24th and then christmas day is like the hours in the day just get shortened because you find yourself cooking for like four hours and next thing is already evening christmas is already done so you want to prep everything through you want to prep everything through from your food to um your gift now a lot of people do keep gifts during christmas it's very important to do but if you don't plan for it on time and wrap them early and you know do all the stuff you intend to do with them for those that actually actually go extra miles to wrap their gifts you might not end up doing what you have in mind and then you have to wait for the next year to come <laughs> so guys if you have any plans for christmas you need to start prepping them if you're traveling you should have started arranging your box by now you don't want to leave anything behind and then let's talk about those who are going to be home for the christmas season now there are a lot of games a lot of exciting things to do with your family i think it's, it's just like one time when everybody's at home at the same time so you just want to have fun play games do decorations so now if you want to do decorations <laughs> if you want to do decorations you should have started by now as well because you want to bring the vibe closer there's this there's this feeling when there's christmas lights and christmas decorations it just makes you feel of christmas the more now in everything i have said it is very important that we know that christ is the reason for this season so everything you should be doing should equally be in line with celebrating the birth of jesus christ <laughs> most people don't remember this they just you know go ahead to have their dirty december it's, it's okay to have a dirty december but at the same time you want to still be calm and calculated you want to still appreciate that you're alive and you still want to take time out to equally map out how your next year is going to be like my prayer every year is to have a better year than the previous so why are you doing all those fun things for christmas why you're um, going on carnivals going on um events and all of that you should equally remember that christ is the reason for the season and that's very important so another thing you want to do this christmas is reaching out to the needy to the less privileged visiting those who uh, um, who actually need help so it's also a way to show that you appreciate that christ died for you <laughs> so please try to reach out please this is not the season to throw away food for no reason you don't need to waste food ever normally but this season is not the season to throw away food so i think on your list you should equally include this too, so it's going to help you there's always an orphanage home close by try to visit one this christmas and you'll be so amazed how god has been faithful to you so um this is actually you know leads you um, guys to having a proper christmas uh, so I wish you have a lovely Christmas celebration in advance. I equally can't wait to, you know, um, do other Christmas content in as much as it's not easy, you know, trying to be in the moment and still try to film. I pray I don't miss any of the important parts, but at the same time, I'm going to do my best to um, vlog some down and hopefully edit and upload for y'all to see how my christmas is going so thank you so much for watching this video please make sure you go back to that list and check it through there are some things i must not have mentioned that you might remember just going through it and that's it guys <laughs> so see you guys in my next video thank you for watching i hope this video actually helps you because it should <laughs> Okay, guys. See you. Bye.